Doctors. <laughs> no, you don't. You're the Doctor. There's a very small number of people who really you know how to tackle the Daleks, and you're one of them. It's really sad. I've gone to sign cheques before. <laughs> <laughs> Then it really have was time for you to leave, mate. Yeah. And have, like, have, they been, have they been accepted? No. <laughs> really sadly as well, like when me and David were sort of making the uh, when we were making the anniversary special, I'd start like signing off to him eleven. And he'd sign off ten. And it was just Yeah, it was really, really ridiculous. <laughs> this isn't the part though that you could leave behind. Is it there'll always be a, yeah. a part of you that's connected? I'm really proud of it. I'm really proud that I've that I've got to do it and have a go and uh, and I've come through it. You know, I I didn't even know if I'd get through a year. You know, you don't know if they're going to give you the elbow. So I'm I'm I'm, I'm pleased I did four. Very very pleased. And what about you, Stephen? How is that? What feelings does that moment of transition stir in you? Well, it's, it's not the fiction that stirs anything in you, it's the fact. And my mate Matt's leaving the show, and, uh, and we joined together. Yeah. And we've had, I mean, this is the last day that we will do panels together about Doctor Who. Um, and that's, uh, so, what's it like uh, losing Matt? I think every, Dig as deep as you like, uh, talk to as many people as you want. You won't find anyone with a negative story about Matt Smith. Not one single person. Um, Marcus Wilson always says he tries to get Matt as early as possible. I'm sorry about this, Matt, we can tell you this now. As early as possible to the set before he's needed because the crew move faster if he's there. <laughs> he's bounding onto the set every day, joyously. <laughs> Um, uh, he hugs everybody, he says hello to everybody, he remembers the names of everybody, everybody's kids. He's been such an extraordinary ambassador for the show. And while he's, he's as you can see, he's not really like the Doctor. Um, he, but the, he's, he's quite a different man. All that, all that eccentricity was performance. But he's some, I, I can honestly say that the way uh, Matt carried himself as the Doctor is something of which the Doctor would be immensely proud. <laughs> and, Oh my goodness. Um, How long have you got? <laughs> <laughs> um, it's a straight. Uh, it's a. It's going to be. Um, it's what. It's what, again. It's what the show is. I can't quite contemplate it because we're not there yet. And what will happen is we'll go off on a on a different journey. But I think what you kind of realise is it's it's this kind of amazing moment of time and you just realise you're never going to get that again together. And I think so much of the last episode for me felt like that and felt like you know. I'm going to be 60, 60 years old and I always look back on you know, my time with my first doctor and, and with Matt and it's just a very special, um, and, it, and it just, you know, it feels so soon as well, so yeah. soon between the two of us, so I think, um, yeah, it's, it's, he's just, I think he's one of the greatest, greatest doctors and the best actor I've ever, ever worked with. Whoa. <laughs> Your legs are uh, pretty. <laughs> <laughs> and how is he to direct it? To be well, like, well, after all of this, I can't expect him. He's absolute nightmare. A royal pain in the ass. As Stephen says, yeah, there is not a moment Matt doesn't give it 100 percent and with great pleasure, and it inspires everybody on the set. I was, I was going to say though that there was an amazing connection between Matt and David because when David came back and put on that suit once again. So like about Matt leaving, there was this sense of what this huge thing is that you are as a doctor. Um, and there was a real connection between you two of we've, we've shared this experience together yeah. um, and you both have that same thing of having left it behind, having have to say enough is enough. Yeah. Um, but it was great to work, absolutely great to work with Matt. 